I totally set that up. So right now, I'm gonna show you nerds. I've never taken you here because we don't really, you know, it's it's really weird. Okay. Yes, I have no facial hair. We, since I can remember, and I've lived here since third grade, so I'm 27 right now. So that's like forever ago. We never had a skate park, like a legit skate park. Our skate park was just a bunch of curbs. And I mean, we made the best of it. The most legendary curb of all. I don't want to show you guys the real park yet. So this is called the Orange Curb, but they painted it gray because they're a bunch of jerks. And all we had were just a bunch of curbs for like manis and grinds, and we got like the planter over here. You know, this was our skate park. That's where I learned how to skateboard. It's a bunch of curbs, nothing really that cool. They wanted to build a skate park, and it's actually a pretty decent skate park, but it's just so flooded now. With a bunch of people and little kids that get in your way. It just doesn't feel like the skate park anymore. This used to be like an abandoned, like skater owned territory, I guess you could call it. It was like our territory. But now we got this behind us, which isn't terrible. It's actually really nice, but like I said, we had to come out here, butt crack of dawn just so we could beat like the rush of kids that come here and get in your way and it's just it's just not the same anymore plus they tore down the amp there used to be an amphitheater like right here like an amphitheater a dome they teared that down without like anybody in town really agreeing to do that so this whole park just looks different man when i first did that i thought i was so cool that that bridge where is it hello that bridge right there. Call that the bridge. But yeah, this is a Washington Park where I used to live back in my younger days. I mean, the park's not bad. It's just, it's not the same. I'm gonna try to vlog for you guys because I haven't had my vlog camera handy recently. Got the GoPro. Oh man, plumber's crack. If I, if I drop this, sorry guys. Getting here feels like two summers ago. Because that's when we used to stay here. And now we don't no more. Because we don't like change. And change happens. And the dome is gone. I already said that. The dome is gone. I wanted to show you guys what I'm going through to get this shot. It's a lot of shit. The Goombas aren't that bad today, but um, they still just gotta watch out, you know? If, if they see someone doing a trick, they can't be getting in the way. That's how you survive at the skate park. Hashtag respect. Hashtag restored. Do you recognize me? So, we got some clips at the skate park before it's, we've been here for 10 hours. It's getting a little spicy outside. Of course the Goombas leave as soon as we leave, but it's cool. Go to my house, check out these clips, maybe edit a few Instagram clips for this dude and we'll go from there. You like the two in the sun, Jesse? Yeah? Got a skylight. <laughs> she likes to play where the sun's shining. Is it warm, Mama Luz? Hmm? So when I last filmed, it was Sunday, 
and now it's Tuesday. My vlogging is slacking tremendously. I'm gonna take Jazzy for a walk. This Jazzy for a walk, as I've been doing for the past three days. I slept on my couch again because Jazzy peed on my bed and I have yet to get a new mattress. So I don't really want to sleep on a mattress that's been peed on, that's just gross. Still love the dog, but damn, why you gotta pee everywhere? Um, so let's take this little cochina <laughs> on a walk. You wanna go for a walk? Yeah? You do? You wanna go for a walk? She's ready, let's go. So we're at we're at the walking spot. Let's see if Jazzy wants to go for a walk. You go for a walk? Yeah. Let's go for a walk. You want to go? Yeah. You want to go for a walk? You do. <laughs> okay. We're gonna go for a walk. I'm not gonna take the camera because that's weird. And I'll be back when we are back. Uh, fish tray doesn't give it justice. Sorry, guys. So, we're done with our walk. It's not a hard walk, but it's good for both of us. Because all we do is sit around all day and don't do anything. Right, Jazzy? Oh, she kissed me. Now, go home, eat some breakfast. Then I gotta go to school early to work on some stuff, get my hair cut today. A lot of stuff going on today, actually. A lot of stuff going on. Mmm, I just killed some Razor Bran Crunch. Jazzy. Ah, <laughs> oh, she tried to hyperextend my kneecap. Okay, so now we're going to Take a quick shower, get dressed, go to school, work on some stuff, and I'm gonna take you nerds with me there too. So let's go. We've been here before. We're at my college. I got, it's like 9.30 in the morning. I don't have class till one, all right? Like I said, 9.30 in the morning. I came here because I have to, what could I show you? So this is my portfolio class, which basically means this, you know, after my finish my associate's degree, I have like a small portfolio of the work I've done. So let me slide this over here. Kind of like a promo page of some stuff. This mouse is the loudest mouse in the world, by the way. Oh, motherfucker. Trying. It's that. Looks like mine, dude. I'm pretty sure he stole it from me. <laughs> Whatever, Nero. Oh, man. That one's one of my favorites. That's in the skate shop. In Curb Appeal, because I got two prints. <laughs> oh, nice. I gave it to him. That's cool, dude. That's not jazzy, guys. It's not jazzy. New Mexico. Mexico proud. Little fucking turds. Well, it's not the land of entrapment photography at the end. So basically I just have to resize these for print so I can actually put them in my portfolio. Okay. It's 11 o'clock. Time lapse or not a time lapse. This is probably an angle you never wanted to see me at, but I'm getting a hole in my pants. And it makes me sad. That is all. Got him. You let me know tomorrow what your decision is. I'm not... Huh? I'm with you, whatever you decide to do. Just to give me a warning. I know it's wrong, but... We're, I'm asking, I was asking him if... Uh, if we were gonna go to class tomorrow, criminal justice, and 
The only reason we do this is because, particularly in that class, we have no more quizzes. The only work we have left is a two-page paper, which is like our final for the class. It's criminal justice. So every time we go there, we don't really do anything, but just like have a discussion about like random like events or trials. And this thing is, this class, if you remember from like my first, was it my first vlog that I did? This class is on the Air Force Base, which is like, so not only is it a waste of gas, it's a waste of time to go all the way out there if there's really no meaning. Pretty much caught up, we've done all our work, blah, blah, blah. And of course, she's like, oh yeah, come on in, we'll talk about this. whatever. So, <laughs> it's a bad it's a bad trend we've been doing with this class in particular. But, we'll go like on Monday, and we won't go on Wednesday. <laughs> Just because there's no point, he's wasting his gas. Every time he takes me to class, I buy him lunch because he drives me there. We go together. So it's like we're both wasting money when we don't even really have to be there because we're not. there's not any work to complete anymore. Like we already did our presentation. I did my presentation on Ray Rice. The, the uh, what was he, the running back for the Baltimore Ravens. I did my my case case presentation on Ray Rice. And I got a 100% you know, on that. We had our quizzes. I mean, it's a super easy class. I mean, if it was located here, it wouldn't be that bad. But it's like 15 minutes that way. It's, it's literally a, like a waste of gas for nothing. And I'm all, I'm all for going to school, but if there's, if there's no point, if I know what's gonna happen, AKA nothing, why am I gonna go? But this is probably going to be a very long vlog. If you're still watching, kudos to you guys because this has been a pretty long one. I'm getting my facial hair back. I don't think I explained the story as to why my facial hair is no longer there. So here's the deal. Women, you probably don't even know. Women, you can't, you guys can't even relate, okay? So as a male, for me, I can't draw, grow. For me, I can't grow like a very strong and thick beard. So my beard is short at best. If it gets any longer than, I don't know, like a, a two guard, guys, guys, you know what I'm talking about. Usually, you know, like a, a one or two, if it's any longer than that, it just starts to look gross and it starts to look like pubic hair and it, it kind of looks patchy. So I was trying to trim up my beard so I wouldn't look like a hobo because my last vlog, this camera happens to pick up a lot of detail and I looked like a hobo in my last vlog. I'm probably gonna flash a clip of my terrible facial hair back then. So that was gross. So I was like, I need to trim this bad boy because this thing's out of control. So I started trimming it, completely screwed it all up. I had the wrong guard on to start with. So I already looked like I was 12. I decided, you know what? We're just gonna shave it all. I went all the way bare baby face again and I instantly regretted it afterwards. I think I shaved it Wednesday, Wednesday or Thursday of last week and my hair's barely coming back. Like I'm barely getting a shadow again, which is good because I hate not having, I'm just used to having, everyone's used to seeing me in facial hair. I like having facial hair. It doesn't make me look like I'm 12, going to my first t-ball game. So that's the story on why my facial hair looks like I don't have any and I don't look the same. If you guys did enjoy it, I know I've been slacking. I say it all the time, I've been slacking but this vlog has a lot in it from the previous days, what I've been doing. I'm still undecided as to when I'm gonna come back to live streaming. To be honest, it's it's actually really nice not having, not having to live stream every day at a certain time because I have a lot more free time to get stuff done, which is the whole reason I took a break. So I've been really enjoying it, but with the summer coming up, I have, I wanna say the last week of school is like the week of the 13th. So May 13th is like the last day-ish of school. So I'm pretty much gonna start live streaming somewhere around there. I probably won't have such a strict schedule. 
like I was, just so it doesn't feel like so grindy, like it's somewhere I have to be at a certain time. But I'm definitely gonna try to keep it on some kind of schedule, just so you guys know when to tune in. I appreciate you guys watching the vlog and supporting me this whole time, even though I've been on a little hiatus. I have been getting some stuff done that I need to. More time for filming as far as skating goes. Uh, being social, which is something I haven't been doing at all. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribing is free. The button's right below. And I'll see you nerds next time. See you. Jazzy's hobo bed. Cha 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 cha. Random clips of Jazzy shaking her tail. Da 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 da.